42 Doug got out of jail at the end of last year and has returned this summer with another full-length album, Forever Us, Never Them. I personally have not been the biggest fan of 42 Doug. I feel like when you take an audit of all the amazing talent coming out of Michigan in the past five to seven years, Doug is probably the most formulaic and boring. Of all the songs I've heard from him, I only really gravitated towards Maybach and We Paid Was Cool. And for artists like him, the big singles are often the only records I think have real replayability. And in my opinion, that sentiment carries through on this album. On this project, 42 Doug makes the same song on the same Detroit beat over and over. The only thing I think stands out about him is his voice. That in itself is pretty distinct. While outside of that, this album blends into one church bell ringing, street shit rapping long song with a little bit of my mama told me sentimental content here and there. An album with Black Youngster on it in 2024 should alone let you know how dated this album sounds and feels. But some highlights to shine through the monotonous muck were Since When with ESTG, who's been sorely missed on my playlist, and I didn't hate NPO with Sexy Red. I thought it was a bit of refreshing ratchetness in this pot of sameness that this album is. At this point, there's no real reason to listen to 42 Doug when it comes to rappers from Michigan, especially when you have Babyface Ray and V's, who are actually creative and provide the same thing, but with a lot more variety and creativity, and are, in my opinion, just higher level rappers. But if you like standard boring street shit, you'll probably love this album. Like if you still bump 2006 GZ all day and you don't like new hip hop, you'll probably love it. But that's not who I am. Scoring 42 Dugs, Forever Us, Never Them, a 4.5 out of 10.